Hi everyone, I'm Nancy. Just going to do a quick intro and then we're going to get right into our planners. And this is for the hashtag Plan With Me Monday 23. And it is hosted by the fabulous Lene. And she is from the fashionably 50 something and beyond. But before we get into the planner, I just wanted to open up my candy from this 31 days of Halloween and it is the countdown to Halloween is on and this is for supporting the Ferrero's 31 days of Halloween program and the donation went to the Children's Miracle Network Hospitals. This was really an awesome awesome calendar. I did it last year. I'm so excited to be included doing it again this year. The $31 this is just like the best advent calendar ever. So anyway I am opening up box number three and I got one of my favorite candy bars in the whole wide world and it is a Baby Ruth fun size bar. So anyway let's get on to the planners and we will catch you guys later. I hope everyone goes out has an awesome week. Take care everyone. Stay safe. Be kind. Be happy. Enjoy life. Have some fun. Love you guys so much and we will see you in our next video. Bye bye. Hi everyone and I am starting with the first planner that I use. I use two planners right now for the week. The first one is my wellness journal and I'd like to thank our hostess first, Lene from Fashionably 50 something and beyond. She hosts this awesome collab which is hashtag plan with me Monday 23. This is an open collab. Everyone is free to join in with whatever type of planner that you use and just kind of share how you're using your planner and it's just exciting to see how everybody can interpret the planners and do something different. So anyway this one I'm a little bit behind. I got that Barbie kit last week and I was so excited to use this and I should have used this back to a uh, school kit for the last week but anyway I jumped in. I used that Barbie kit because it was so cute. So this week I've got the back to school kit in here and this is for the week September 18th through Sunday the 24th. And again this is one it's just I'm doing to kind of chart my program trying to get back to being healthy. Um, I work 61.5 hours that week. Uh, my under desk elliptical that I use while I'm working. Uh, for the week I got in 26,851 steps. I had done that for 6.9 hours during the week. Um, the total miles I did on the uh, under desk elliptical was $10. $10. 10.73 miles. The Fitbit actually on Sunday when I took my shower I plugged in my Fitbit forgot to put it back on so it's a little warped but anyway the total on the Fitbit is showing 9,949 for the week. I know that's not good that's why I'm trying to get back into wellness slowly. Alrighty, so getting to use my main planner right here. I use the Happy Planner for both my wellness journal, but for on my main planner, I use their big Happy Planner. I like the horizontal style where I'm putting different pictures in here. I just want to be able to use some big pictures, and if I'm writing text or journaling, I need the space to write because I am a messy, messy writer. Alrighty, so getting into, I'm using the same week that I did in my wellness journal. So Monday, September 18th through Sunday, September 24th. So back to work on Monday, nothing special about that. I uploaded my Mask Monday and I also had finished editing and scheduled out two videos that I had done over the weekend. On Tuesday I uploaded Timu Tuesday. It was my haul number 26 and Halloween style number 2. Wednesday I uploaded my book of the month and oh my gosh the books that I picked out I'm so excited I can't get wait to find a chance to read it but uh, but so on Thursday, because on when I did the book of the month, I just kind of said out loud that I am going to open the book that I started a few months ago and I am going to finish it because I want to get into some of the new books that I've ordered. And so Thursday night after work and after working on YouTube for a couple of hours, I went back to my book. She started it. 
oh my gosh this is an awesome awesome book i've been reading it all week i've got about 80 pages left and i can't wait to see what is going to happen next it is really uh, a great horror thriller story i also ordered from purple toad i wanted to get some november fall wines i love purple toad winery they're out of paducah kentucky and I, they have some of the best sweet wines around so i ordered some for november on friday ending the work week i uploaded my wine diaries i like to do a wine diary on friday and maybe opening up a new bottle of wine from wink or something i've got in my collection maybe from bino or maybe even purple toad and then having a little bit of dinner with it on saturday i did a video on how i put on my timu wigs because i know i use a lot of different wigs in my videos they're just kind of a fun accessory for me but i know some people think it's really cumbersome and really hard to put on wigs and i have got i've got an awful awful hair i've got a mop of hair and if i can get them under wigs i just thought i would show people um, how I put it in. It's probably not the best way. If you went to a wig shop, they're probably going to show you something else, but this is quick and easy and it works for me. On Sunday to end the week, I had lots and lots of coffee. I wanted to work on my planner for the week before just to make sure I got all my thumbnails printed and anything that I wanted to put in there. I also had done a couple of videos and got them edited so that I could schedule them out during the week. I also made a little list of what I wanted to do for October. So I ordered some Halloween wines. I ordered my November fall wines, actually the purple toad that had come in. I ordered some Christmas coffee flavors and a cookie advent calendar to do for my Vlogmas in December. I had to go downstairs and bring up my boxes of costumes and start to figure out what still fits, what doesn't fit and um, also started my next DAV donation box for some clothing that doesn't fit or I just don't wear anymore since I'm not working in the office. I really don't need a lot of business clothes anymore. So starting to weed those out. To end the month, I just used this old thumbnail that I had from maybe two years ago. It was uh, when I was doing my Scentsy Halloween warmers and so I just kind of got them all out on the table right here. Of course, dressed up in costume and a little sticker. I love fall pumpkin, spice, and all things nice. And again, I want to thank our hostess, Lene, from 50 something and beyond and for starting this awesome collab again it's an open collab that anyone can join you just use that hashtag um, plan with me monday 23 and they post on mondays but i suppose if you just get around to posting in the middle of the week once you get it edited as long as you use that hashtag we can all find you and it's just a fun way to work on your planner and show your planner maybe it keeps you honest and keeping up with your planner because you know you're going to show it to someone and it's just really really fun for me so again i want to thank Lene and everyone who watches this video you guys are awesome Thank you so much. I hope you go out. Have a fabulous, fabulous week. Take care, everyone. Stay safe. Be kind. Be happy. Enjoy life. Have some fun. I love you all, and I can't wait to see you in our next video. Bye-bye.